So I just caught this humongous pompano. But look at this. This thing is huge. Woo! Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video with Fishing Vlog. Today, we're gonna be fishing at Orange Beach. We're gonna be fishing for pompano. Hope it's gonna be a pretty exciting day. Um, it's pretty beautiful outside today. Um, see you guys when we get to the beach. All right, guys, we are at the beach. As I said earlier, it is a, a pretty beautiful day on the beach. Um, we are setting up right now. It is really beautiful. Guys, this is basically what we're gonna be using for bait. We're using some easy flea fish bites. Uh, maybe some fish and shrimp. Uh, some shrimp fish bites. Then we're fishing for pompano. So I think we're mainly gonna be using the um, sand. Uh, no, the yeah sand flea. All right, guys. So my dad is casting out right now. Maybe like 15 minutes, and if I'm gonna bite, I'm gonna reel in and check to see if my bait's still there. See you guys. All right, guys, I'm gonna see how far I can try and throw this football. All right. Ah, uh, wasn't that far, but I mean, I tried. So my dad just cast it out, just cast it out, this second rod. Now we're gonna have two rods out. Um, so we have better chances of catching the fish. I'm gonna try to use the jig. Um, and I hope I will catch something with this jig. And, are you guys to get me action? Oh, God. I don't have a fish on. I'm just gonna show you guys what I made for doing. It's broken. I didn't want to fall. Ooh, I thought I just got a bite. Yeah, there definitely is some activity out here with the jig. Um, but I, I did just get a bite. Or uh, I thought I had a bite. Um, so yeah. Alrighty guys, so this time, I'm gonna be seeing how far I can throw this ball. Now, I do play baseball, and um, hope for Spanish Fort Toro's um, 10 U travel ball. It's pretty, it's pretty fun. Um, but we're gonna see how far I can throw this ball. Ready? I'm the man of the rods. Gotta watch the rods. Yep, I do. That's what I gotta do. Right, guys so I just caught this humongous pompano but look at this this thing is huge Woo. guys that was some hard one Woo. Woo that is pretty decent fish Yeah. Kill it. Get it. Put a knife between them. Between it. Yeah. Where? Uh, that 
is a humongous pompano. Like, wow. Alrighty guys, see when we catch another one. Alright guys, look at this. This thing is huge. Uh, I'm gonna try and put it in this cooler right here. Golly, this thing is big. So it's about maybe 10 or 11 inches. It's pretty big. So Dean's Pompano was actually 19 inches total length. It was a big, healthy fish. And the timing is super crazy, but I was in the parking lot grabbing something from the truck when Dean caught this fish. So there's no footage. I didn't bring the tripod. I didn't bring his chest mount for the GoPro. So it was either get footage of the rod going off or catch the fish. And he chose to catch the fish. Way to go, Dino. All right, guys, well, some people moved right beside us. It looks like they're about to launch a drone. And this will be pretty cool. Um, I think they're setting it off right now. Um, but it looks like they're about to launch it. Um, I'll show you guys when they launch it. I'm just trying to keep you guys entertained. Um, yeah, they're launching it. their bait all with the drone look there's their bait attached to that drone dad dad look yeah their bait uh, attached to that drone yeah, that's what, that's what I, was to oh. I didn't know that i have never seen that before like never in my life that is really cool guys that's the first time i've seen that like in my life like that was pretty cool all right guys so we just got a kite up um, um it's pretty cool um i don't know how to tie a thing or yeah i don't know how to tie the string to this and this went flying over there and, and the kite just like just flew over there and i had to chase it but i was like like all the way, like it was all the way over there to, to those yellow poles. Well, guys, uh, it looks like this is the end of our fishing trip. We're gonna go back to the house, clean the fish, and eat the fish. So it's gonna be a catch clean cook. Um, so yeah, see you guys when we get to the house. Um, I'm going to start up here to get, make sure we get all of the head meat. Yep. Okay. That's and I'm just going to follow the back. I'm going to make an outline of the fish here. Yep. Yep. Is that how he does it, Cat Cat? Yes. All right. Flip it over, get the other side. Yep, that's right. All right, keep your fingers out of the way, Catherine. While Daddy cuts this. She don't want to get cut in. Yep, three. You guys ready to eat? Yep. Yeah. I like it. Fresh pompano. Now look at this All right, both of you give me a good pompano. 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 Look at this. Whoa. Gorgeous meat. Look at that gorgeous meat. Yeah. Are you going to eat that? Yeah. Yeah? You see I'm holding up the meat. <laughs> Why are you holding the fish? <laughs> because it's fun. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Good. We're going to make 
Bonefish's Pan Asian Sauce. They posted the recipe years ago. Super easy, super quick, and freeze as well. So make yeah. a double batch. We're just gonna make the single tonight because we're gonna scarf it all down. We're gonna put it on fish, put it on chicken. It's amazing. Trying to get a cup of ketchup in there? Yep. I'm now going to have one cup of oyster sauce. This might be a little while. you got to tap the bottom like a bottle of ketchup. So what are you doing, Dean? I'm putting in a quarter of a cup of soy sauce. Making sure that I don't go over. There we go. All right, what's next? And then we need a quarter of a cup of water. All right, we got the olive oil hot. Let's get this ginger going. Ooh, that sizzle is like the best sound. Ooh. It smells really good too. Oh. Ooh. oh, the sound of that was just so satisfying. Oh my gosh. I wish you could smell that. It smells really good mm. with the ginger. It does. The fragrance of the ginger is outstanding. It smells like pear. One of the very important tricks of this recipe is to very slowly stir in a quarter of a cup of sugar. You don't want it to go up. Slow. No, Mama. All right. The beauty of this is that we can just Ooh. put a little black bean seasoning on and call it good. Yeah. Fish, chicken, doesn't matter. Guys, I don't know if you, I don't know if you guys know this, but I love asparagus. <laughs> like asparagus is one of my favorite vegetables. Um, aside uh, green beans. All right, we're getting the asparagus off. Oh, that smells so good. All right, guys, let's start up with a quick prayer here. All right, I'm gonna let you do it, Kat Kat. Give me God, thank you, Sam, for our wonder day. I uh, hope we have a great dinner. And join your dinner. And amen. 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 Good. Good bless me, Kevin. Right. Do you want fish or chicken? I'll have some. You want some pompano? I'll have some fish. Okay. There you go. Some really good fish. Good. Thanks for catching it, Dino. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. You're... Remember to like and subscribe. You can eat your... And as always, stay wild and keep fishing. Keep fishing. <laughs> and, then, and then you can eat this all up and then watch a movie if you want to or go to bed.